Here's your shopping list for next week's All You Can Eat All Nighter. We'll be starting off the night with Nicole Kidman and Tom Cruise in Days of Thunder and making Tom's Cruise Control Turbo at 805 Eastern next Friday. But stick around. Rick Springfield stars in Hard to Hold next on 80s Night. You can eat that biscuit? It's all yours, sir. Oh, can I have a little bit of it? Uh, well, you'll have to fight fight among yourself. Would this be considered right. a disorderly? Uh, <laughs> no, it was fairly orderly. You know, it's really good. This, by the way, the ham was was so good, and the, yeah. and the mustard greens and, and it everything. was good. What I like is good. taking it and dipping it in mm. this uh, so the sauce here. We're still here with uh, Sergeant Mike Arminio of the Los Angeles Police Department. Was kind enough to stop by. It was so nice. Of you. I know. Thank you. Now, now, Mike, is this what happens when you solve a crime? You immediately write a rap song about it, like the way they wrapped up this movie. Is that 1987 <laughs> or what? No, that's not my favorite part of the movie, so I just mm -hmm. I turn down the volume and watch the credits. Oh, that's what you're supposed to do. Yeah, <laughs> good tip. Movie we'll watching tips from the LAPD. Now, is that an official sanctioned advice, you think? Or? No, I'm uh, off duty, so it's oh. uh, kind of on my own. Okay. Well, since you're off duty, we yeah. might as well. Got some dirty dishes. Yeah. You know. Want to help us with that? Because oh, you've had I'd, your meal. You know, I'd, I'd love to. That's I'd, I'd, There's nothing I'd rather do. Oh, you got a fake mm -hmm. page coming in? You better tend to that. What is it? It's a uh, quick think. It's a major 415. <laughs> What's a 415? A, it's a major disturbance at a at a donut shop down oh. on the, <laughs> down on Ventura Boulevard. Oh, are you gonna um, go to your uh, major disturbance in an apron? When the, when that dough starts blowing up, uh, it'll probably come in handy. So. Oh uh, well, yeah. Take it. I'd love to contribute any way I can to law enforcement. And we appreciate all the Thanks help, man. So much for coming by. Thank you very oh, much for having me. You're a trooper. You, Actually, you, I know you're a sergeant. So. You know, you don't want to forget your license plate. Wouldn't want you getting no. a ticket on your way down there to your major disturbance. And your picture of you and Jack Webb. Thank you. There you go. Thanks very much. So it's okay to call you if, like, somebody's in my house rooting around. Yeah, uh, me or another of the uh, nine thousand guys will show up. So how about all nine thousand of you? I got well, a big. I got give a big us yard. overtime. Huh? All nine thousand of us will show up. <laughs> Good. Thanks a lot. Thanks again. Mike Arminia, come on, ladies. See ya. To serve and protect. So I'm going to give him just a, my, uh, my cop look. Mm -hmm. Now that he's gone, I think the, uh, the void mm -hmm. can only be filled by reading the liner notes to Jack Webb's jazz album. All right, you done with your, by the way, have you scraped mm -hmm. the clean? Okay. Mm -hmm. don't, don't get up and help me. <laughs> don't worry, I won't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Jack Webb talks this album. He talks it because he yearns to be part of the world of music. He has nothing else to contribute. What? It says he yearns can't to be say a part. That. He yearns to be a part of the world of music. Oh, and he has nothing else to contribute. Oh. So, and then, and then at the bottom of it, this kills me. Mm -hmm. The record may sell enough to force Jack Webb to turn in his shield. Worse things have happened. That's I don't think so. so. Scary. I don't think worse things have happened.